everybody. This video is about DHT blockers for hair growth for both men and women. Stick around. Okay, first of all, you may ask, what is DHT? It stands for dihydrotestosterone, which is an androgen hormone made from testosterone. Related to hair loss though, Testosterone converts to DHT with the help of an enzyme contained in the oil glands of our hair follicles. So DHT binds to those receptors in your hair follicles and the hair follicles begin to shrink and will eventually stop new hair growth altogether. So by blocking that process, your hair is able to grow again. Now, there could be various reasons why you're losing your hair. It's not just this genetic component and it's important to understand that this video is specific to the genetic reason but yeah you could be losing your hair due not just to genetics but certain illnesses and conditions hormonal changes medications and stress are many of the reasons that people can start to lose their hair i know when i had my appendix ruptured for five days in another video I had extreme hair loss for a few months until my body could start regenerating its health again and it took a severe impact on my hair. So although hair loss is often related to male pattern baldness, hair loss isn't just a male issue. And though although hair loss can't always be reversed, knowing what's at the root of the hair loss is critical in managing it. Like I said before, genetics is the most common cause of male and female hair loss and it's called androgenetic alopecia in other words it's called hereditary balding it is genetic and is caused by a reaction to androgen and it occurs after puberty and it's responsible for gradual hair loss not just in men but also in women and it's important to note too that in women this type of hair loss is associated with an increased risk of PCOS, which just stands for polycystic ovarian syndrome. And PCOS is characterized by hormonal imbalance that can lead to irregular menstruation, acne, excess hair elsewhere on the body, and weight gain. And the overproduction of DHT in women is often the result of excessive testosterone production. But if you're looking to fight hair loss, you may want to start with lowering your dihydrotestosterone levels. So DHT blockers include supplements and also medications that will block DHT levels. And some of those natural foods and supplements include green tea, onions, edamame, coconut oil, turmeric, soy products, tomatoes, pumpkin seeds, carrots, almonds, and nuts, bananas, watermelons, mushrooms, and spinach. I will leave a list of all of these below for reference for you. And if these natural ways don't really help you, seek medical attention and see if there are some supplements that the doctor can prescribe you. I've read that there's some very good beneficial medications out there that can help you as well. But if all else fails, you know what? Bald is beautiful. Who cares if you're bald? You're beautiful. Embrace it, love yourself, be confident, and you'll be gorgeous. And with that, I hope you guys have a great day. Hope this video helped you. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.